<laughs> There's no time where Bomers talks apart from the start, by the way. How would you know? He's checked it, he's cheated. He's watched the video. <laughs> yeah. We might talk at the end, I'm not sure if that's dropped out for the video or not. Loser's quarterfinal. Uh, yeah. Because it's the third round from the end of the loser's bracket. Yeah. I'm ready. No one else is ready, apparently. Hey, guys. Yeah. Yes. I gotta pee. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen and jellyfish enthusiasts, welcome to the loser bracket quarterfinals matchup between Potato on Crack and green bulmers it's gonna be an interesting one today i am excited Axe, are you excited well... oh thank you for the sub sub green bulmers 21 months of sub subbing thank you for the sub 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 uh. I don't know what you mean, Bulmer. I I can because I don't know what time potatoes are gonna get. I d I don't even I'm not sure what time Bulmer's got to be honest. <laughs> the bar's there because it's paused, Bulmer's, and you can't see like the actual time. It didn't show the length of the video, I don't think. It'll, it'll go when it starts playing. Yeah. So, Axe, who do you think is going to win? The fans. The fans, that is a good answer. Okay, I'm back. I'm, I'm ready. You can just do the countdown if you're ready. Okay, we're going to do the countdown. Wait, this one was ready. Ha ha ha. Yes, okay. Take it away, Axe. We're gonna do a countdown in 700, 700, 700, go! I was really one, hoping you were gonna say go there. One interesting countdown accent on 3 times 41. Welcome. You know, I always, I always thought that 41 is the best number, and they all say 3 is a magic number, so that's why I went with 1, 2, 3. Fair. Is that actually why you did it, or did you just go one, two, three? Is that actually why you did it, or did you just go one, two, three? I just went one, two, three. Ah. I mean, no. Of, of course, I went forty. My forty-one times tables. Um. So yeah, we've got green bulmers on the async, and we've got potato on crack doing it live, and unedited. Uh, Bulmer's getting in his car slightly ahead of Potato. Oh, nice, uh, the strat. On both ends. But Potato got for Wasp, I don't believe Bulmer's did. Uh, no, he didn't, he only had 62 points there. So... And Potato also made up, like, two seconds in my mm -hmm. Very speedy, is Potato in these, uh, early game situations. He... He does have Comsop in uh, one zero, I believe. Now oh, there you have it. Almost again going for a bush trap. Oh, it gets one the wasp. Yeah. 
That makes sense. He needed a wasp, but uh, it's good. Hmm. You can see by this reset, he's still only a couple of seconds behind. RTA sink on that reset. So I I was in discussions with Bulma's idea, getting a bit of the inside scoop. Ooh. And uh, you know, apparently Bulma's was okay uh, doing going into a run. He, you know, sometimes people are a little nervous. Sometimes they're a bit tired. You know, sometimes. We've had a few people not wanting to play too much, but Bulmers was okay doing it. To be fair, he did have to put up with me, so you know. He he was also awake and on his day off. <laughs> Thrilling. Disgusting. Thrilling. Yeah. I well, did have I to ask so. Bulmers several questions for him to be able to answer that question. <laughs> If you want the scoop, I, I know. Uh, I I, I, I asked I... Bulmers if he was confident going into a run, and he said it's spoiling it. Fair. Did you know that Green Bulmers has a 100% win record over Potato on Crack on the Speed Simpsons channel? I gave it to Barney. Oh, does he? Was it part of the uh, Rats versus Jaggers? Uh, I, I have a feeling. I don't think Bulmers is in that. I thought it'd be um the uh, World Cup. I don't know what race that is. Yeah, I just it has to be Rice Chagas, because didn't Bulmers do I'm pretty sure Bulmers was in bar was one and Potato was in bar oh. two, I believe. Let's find out. Uh, but I did not ask him as okay. spoilers. I was just asking his mentality going into the game, and he assumed it was spoilers. Spoiler talk. But my journalism would not lead me to ask for spoilers. I could just spoil the problem. I can't. I don't remember his time. But in theory, I could. I could go to the video, go to the end, and spoil the time. Uh, news flash, Axie is being banned from journalism for spoiling, for attempting to spoil, attempted spoiling. How's the predictions looking? Oh, I, six, nine donuts on potato there. I, I asked all the questions I would normally ask somebody going into a race. <laughs> you should have asked them before his race. Well, if we did I, I asked him if he felt like he was going to win. I asked everybody before a race if they're going to win. Look at this synced Plough King purchasing. Uh, at least in terms of RTA. Does mean Potato has a two and a half second lead or so? There's a lot of donuts going in on this one. Oh, look at that. Another hundred into the potato there. What a race so far. I agree. Okay, they're both going to make very close to simultaneous contact with Wayland Smithers here. Good hit by both sides. Bulmers having to take a wider turn. There's a school bus. But they both get their strat. And I believe it's a, th well, a three hit for Bombers, yeah. a four hit for Potato. Oh, a poker destruction. But Potato oh, oh, has like a second or so lead. Uh, but he also messed up slightly on the, uh, he did a pause, unpause. Yeah, that, of the... he had a second because of that. Yeah. Well, I, I timed afterwards. Don't you worry. Oh, uh, and doesn't get the same cycle Bombers does, though. Uh, it looks like they're on pretty much the oh, same. Okay. I think they got the same yeah, one, but I think it was a bit slow getting to the third tower cut from this. Yeah. Normally, Potato does some weird hybrid of uh, button jump and DSS and going up the thing. Speaking of DSS, he grabs it. They're both doing. Potato is still second ahead.
both on a singular freebie so far. Standard for ASM, unless you do uh, <laughs> all roof. <laughs> Oh, thank you, Roman. No. Oh, thank you. Thank you for letting us know. How will you feel going into the next cutscene? Well, we don't know. He's not at that cutscene yet. Ah, oh, true, true. Well, no, I'm asking in advance because he's got to leave now for the rest of his race, so he'll hear it. And the next time he uh, goes into a cutscene, he'll be a, he'll have that question fresh in his brain. He, he doesn't even... That's like half an hour. It won't be fresh. I was going to say, his opinion will change because it could partially depend on how well Potato is doing compared to him. He could also miss, miss a cutscene. Mm, no, that is true. Okay, it could be like 15 minutes the next cutscene. We yeah, got me that. I didn't do it. So, Max, who is your favourite florist and why is it Irene? My favorite florist. Yes. And why is it Irene? Florist just in Simpsons? In general. All uh. time favorite florist. All need of them getting the freebie in the trailer park. And Potatoes back around a bit stuck at the end there. Is that enough to give Bulmers a slight lead? I think they're about level. Actually, I think Potato is still a second ahead, or maybe a little less, 0.8 or something. I don't know, Klaus mm, Wagner going into my historical florists right now. Did you just Google famous florists? No, I actually... <laughs> him and some of... Historical florists. <laughs> He's, a, he's more of an artist and everything. Oh, uh, okay. Thank you for the subscription D ticker. Oh, Potato doesn't get either freebie. I think Bulma's got one. I saw the coins going up. Yeah, Bulma gets one more small than Potato here. Well, Potato might go for FBI. Not FBI, yeah. Plow King. Uh, Plow King um, 17. 17 now, yeah. Not a bad shout. The thing at this point. He didn't get a uh, trailer park, right? So he he still has two to get. So he might as well just hop into a big, big boy truck. Mm. With having a very similar start to this bone storm, maybe a slight bit better for Bulmers. His trucks are a little earlier than potatoes, but his trucks also been held up more. <laughs> And don't don't forget, the winner of this gets twenty dollar reduce. Oh yeah, they, they guarantee themselves a spot in the top four. Almost against the short but has to turn back slightly for it. They are not too happy, but he hasn't really lost any time to Almost because Almost was actually a bit slower. Yeah, twenty whole dollar reduce. Twenty dollars for that guaranteed fourth player. Minimum that is. Yeah, minimum. Yeah, because I don't know how well, the money splits. It's a hundred to win, fifty uh, for second. So Smith is guaranteed fifty dollars. Uh, Vapo is guaranteed at least thirty dollars. And has is guaranteed at least twenty. Yes. Um Did you know Potato is the uh, last runner in the tournament not on the British Isles? Oh, that's a that's a statement. Mm, we haven't had a British Isles winner of the tournament since twenty eighteen in the cyber time. Yeah, and Vapo was runner up that year, but I'm not sure where Vapo was in the world at that point. Uh, he was in the UAE, yeah. Ah. Uh, but Vapo back in Britain for the finals of this tournament. <laughs> oh, look at the speed, Lumberjack. 
It wasn't the uh, first tournament where Vapors had to switch countries midway through. Um, I don't know. what is he saying this one is? No, he also had to do it in the uh, bingo tournament when he then went on to win oh, the bingo right. tournament. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting is that it's factoid is the word, isn't it? I think that means a fake fact. Uh, yes, I did almost. Yeah, last year also had nobody uh, go uh, lossless. Although mm. the year before, I believe, did because Bacon didn't lose a race in 2019. That sounds about right, yeah. Because his first loss was against Duck Bob. Scyther did lose in 2018 because he lost the first stage of the final against uh, Vapo. Vapo. Yeah, yeah, it's uh, asynchronized, so Bulmas has done his run in the past. He wasn't sure about being able to schedule with Potato. As it turns out, could have done it the whole time. <laughs> yeah, it was mainly because their schedules were bad. Yeah. Uh, I think Bulmas actually has a slight lead there. Yeah, about a second, second and a half, maybe. Yeah, but Tika, you're the former champion. Nobody cares about the former Speed yeah. Simpsons World Champion. You know who else is a former Speed Simpsons World Champion? Vapo? I was going to say Green Bulmers. Oh. Won it off Critch, who then... And then he dropped it to Tika. Yeah, Smith is the current champion. Who's your favourite former World Champion now? Vapo. The correct answer is Death. Uh, no, correct answer is Vapo. Uh -huh, okay, that's fair. You got me there. Guff is a, is a close second, but, you know. Oh, Bull must get back in his house. I'm talking to comic right there. I'm pretty sure Guff will understand when I say Vapo. That's, that's a fair argument. We do have the man with myth legend Guff McGufferson in chat right now. Former world champion Guff McGufferson. Yeah. What a legend of the game. Is he the only sub uh, non sub 130 former world champion? Um, um, possibly. Yeah, people were getting sub 130 by the time you're the first on the world round. The 2019 tournament, I should say. No, I mean, like, right now, like, nobody else is oh, on this. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's on a prestigious list. We haven't even said Bacon yet when talking about former champions. But that goes without saying. It's like, best yeah. of shot, Bacon, like, you, you just you just expect where his name's there. Derek, of course, after winning the 2020 tournament, became champion. Yes, because to begin with, it was just like, pretty much all tournament races up until like, the rival races started. Mm -hmm. There is a timeline where uh, I would have been champion at one point. Uh, I would have been champion that timeline, wouldn't I? Yeah. So no, I, you... I, yeah, no. I would have won it. This, this is the timeline where Smith wins the tournament, right? In 20. Right? No, this is a tournament oh. where Rando was single Elim. Oh, okay. Yeah. If Smith wins the 2020 tournament, I'd then beat Smith afterwards. And I think it like very quickly goes back to the uh, it go it actually goes into the bingo tournament in that uh, universe universe where Smith doesn't fail with the escape. What about the universe where Bulmers actually gets to enter the Rando tourney? Yeah. Mm. Oh, he was knocked out in. Uh, he was yeah. eliminated in prelims, and then, <laughs> and yeah, then the prelims losers. Oh, 
No, it was a prelim loser's bracket as well to enter the loser's bracket. He had two chances to enter the tournament and lost both. <laughs> Oh, who's going to have the shortest reign? The Injustice. Aww, loser. <laughs> oh, I'm listing former champions. We've got Duck Bob. In KSFQ. What have we oh, done? Yeah, but Duck Bob's a strong, strong competitor. Bulbas actually pulled away quite a significant amount here, by the way. He has, so, he has, yeah. Uh, I, I, what, happened, what happened to Potato? Uh, nothing too much. He's just made a few small errors. Like, he hasn't really lost, like, a bucket loads of time, but he's lost, like, a few, a couple of seconds here, a couple of seconds there. A couple of seconds here, a couple of seconds there. Yeah. I, I couldn't make that shit with the rest of the world, Donald. A second here, a second there, here a second, there a second, everyone loses a second. Old Potato loses a second, E-I-E-I-O. <laughs> and on the second he had some tents, E-I-E-I-O. And a hundred here, a hundred there, here a hundred, there a hundred. Everywhere, a damn hundred. Oh, I'm trying to the damn that made it not clear. Oh, boom was on his side. I oh, know. All gets flung out by the train. It's kind of lucky there by how he got flung out. Hmm. Push comes to shove, he could have maybe reset his car and driven in there. He, he would have had time. time. He would have had time. But that lost him like at least like four seconds, mm. I'd say. Yeah, it was definitely some time though. And I didn't even know that had happened. So. <laughs> We're too busy singing, you know. Oh uh, no, I, I mean like when I was watching it the first time. Man. <laughs> a nice, a nice escape from Green Bombers, showing where he does have some skill. <laughs> Got the skills to pay the bills. He's currently leading this loser's quarterfinal. You said you didn't have, you don't have skill. Now we don't talk about that. Potato grabbing the zero with his escape. Uh, Lambton has a 135. Like, disrespect him like that. I didn't say he had skills. What? <laughs> Unless he has the skills to pay the bills. Don't disrespect Axie. He's got like a 133. 134. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, I, I over-respected you. Dust, dust to be fair, I did miss part 2 in it, so, you know, I should have had a 133. My I also, like, lost... I also missed, like, uh, a minute in Curator because of that. No, my 137 missed 2 minutes in... Wait, no, that was a different video. No, no, it missed 2 minutes in 4-2. Yeah. But so we're really, it's one thirty or three or something. That's why we talk about the game. We don't play the game. That's why no, we're that's here. Like... That's why we're Did here. Did you see my we'll NMW run it. the other day? Uh, I walked to seven seven, so I didn't have to finish it. I was like twenty <laughs> minutes right or something. Oh. To be fair, I did six six to six seven drive and a half. You know. Bulma's was just struggling a bit there with the courthouse then. Yeah. But very calmly managed. He done jump. Oh, my ovaries. Lisa did it. Is it gonna take a lead on oh no, if he gets this box he'll take a lead on coins. The potato is surprisingly yeah. like being dropped by bombers here. I wouldn't go that far. Bombers has got a healthy lead. But I think, but uh, I don't think it's that big of one actually. 20 seconds seems about right, but it was more uh, in those of better than these. That train car issue, courthouse, small things that'll draw potato even closer. Uh, I 
more like 13 seconds, but yeah. Um. Attention car! Ten-year-old hitchhiker needs a ride! Welcome! Perfection! My name So... Gonna be like a 21, 39. Yeah, it is. Sucks so for Bournemouth as well. Good first hit there. It doesn't take the momentum away from the uh, Sarks cut, which is nice. Yeah, and you're pretty close to that 13 second. Let's go. Fuck this Hutchmaster team Bournemouth here. Oh, really? That was a strong hit from it, really just giving the Sarks cut extra speed. <laughs> So the key point of the first car is not really slowing it down so you get to the end of this tunnel quicker. 341 out of the tunnel, very nice. Almost having a solid second car here, maybe not as quick as you'd like, but still just trying to get over there is pretty good. Oh, look at the hit on that third car. Actually, I like this, kind of waiting to destroy it so it doesn't, uh, so you don't blow it up too early and end up too far away for a good fourth car. And Potato actually was faster out the second car than Bournemouth was. 6, 637 on there, very speedy. Potato also went for a very good sellout. Well, oh, not as good a start in this fourth car, unfortunately. But, had a bit of a head start. Nah, okay. Bombers has really represented Ireland well this year. Ireland. <laughs> is he only... Was the only Irish participant this year, I believe. Yeah. The Republic of Ireland. I think we had a... Do we have a Northern Ireland? I don't think. Not off the top of my head. Oh, no. That was uh, Regen. I don't think I need to enter the tournament. I think oh, it was Northern no. Irish. Oh, no. This is the cutscene skip. Uh, now I have to find a pad to put that in. But... But yeah, Sorry, Bombers is one of the uh, few people who didn't have somebody else back them up uh, nation-wise. Um, yeah. Well, oh, it's like Bacon Man. I don't think there's any Finns running the game. Other than Finesse, of course. Uh, Bacon. I don't that uh, yeah, no. Uh, yeah, was Slend's the only Spanish one? Mm hmm. Um. Uh, we did have our first Uzbek. Uh, who had no races and dropped out twice. Uh, top hat, Thomas. Mm-hmm. Well, I... Let's check uh, this. We only had... No, we had more than one Scottish runner this year. Questions later. Yeah. Uh... Obviously, Seychelles. <laughs> I don't think that counts. Yeah. We have a French one of them. Does the original still have the French flag? No, he didn't enter. But oh, we did have oh. Lovney. We did have Lovney. Yes. Who yeah, is French, right? Yes. There we go. So I was, I was right with the French one. Um, yeah, we had three Germans. So. Four Germans, even. Yeah, uh, did... yes, hold on. I can't believe I forgot Tilbert like that. <laughs> uh, we had uh, Ukrainian with Bruni. Is that meme still around? <laughs> we had Moldova. We did. Our first Moldovan in the ASM tournament. Then you specified ASM. Nice boat jump by Green Bombers there. Tasty coins, nine 
Next year we should just have the runners come out uh, like the Olympics with like their little flags. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they are doing a, a grind along the top of that wall there. But this is the wrong it's Simpsons game for that. Uh, he missed cuts in skateboard moves. And now he's just, uh, you know... Tilt a bit. <laughs> yeah. Nice bonfire by a bummer there. Oh, the car, you know. The shark and a shark. Yeah, he got caught on the stairs. Just having a really solid run so far, though. We do have a runner from El Salvador now as well, but just not really? in the tournament. Oh, yeah. Uh, Carolina Bean is El Salvador. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, wrong warp by Bulmers. Uh, wrong warp from Bulmers. Yeah, double wrong warp. Warp so good, he has to do it twice. And now he doesn't have ESS for a decently long pan in. Yeah, well, he used the ESS the first time he warped to 3 1. Gets himself a Ute, though. Very nice. Ah, uh, not doing Bulmers warp. What's Bulmers warp? Cheeky little thing where you get out of a car. Alright. Oh no, they both have their classes on screen. Just you can only see Bournemouth some of the time. <laughs> As opposed to potatoes most of the time. Okay, first cut. On the first tree, and it's moving off in one hit. Uh, about as perfect as it can go, and just leave that to destroy itself. Keep your momentum going the whole time. And he's got wonky driving. Look at that. And I only know because Bournemouth Wonky. Look at that one. It's wonky to rock a rhyme to rock a rhyme that's right on time. Oh. It's wonky. I believe School Bus is considered one of the better wonky parts. Nice to the uh, Dan Count Crusty in Squad Start. By the root vegetable. Oh, that, that camera flick back was a little late from Bulmers, but that was a perfect... Still got a decent shot. Well, it wasn't perfect because he ended up facing the wrong way, but... Uh, well managed. Backup. So oh, he didn't go the right way. He backed up in the wrong direction, right? Hey. <laughs> perfect last one, I think. Spoilers. Oh, look at that. Absolute perfection. I have never seen anything better. Oh, I've had perfect last cards also. Uh, he's getting out of his car, a bit risky. It's not that low on the health. Um, he switched to Malibu. Okay. <laughs> yeah, the car was second. Uh, it looked iffy. Potato is catching up now. Yeah, Wonky Driving School Bus is generally considered good. Yeah, Potato is actually has got quite a lot here. It doesn't, it, it's like Macquarie was in bar and not, like, say, in better than beef. Basically got most of that cut in. Yeah, Bombers is just suffering from... Good last card too by Potato. Oh, that was... Yeah. Nick doing his best to slow down Bombers there. Was not able to get in front. Oh, now he is. Oh, it's dropped behind him. Oh, there's a. Oh no! Lisa Simpson at your service. Oh, potato takes the lead. Potato takes the lead. Um. Perfect designer jeans. The foulest of all crimes. 
Yeah, that was really rough. It was very hard to commentate because that was the one thing I remembered about the run, and I remembered it about 32 minutes ago. Oh, it's pretty funny. Yeah. That was really rough. Oh, and Potato gets a brilliant drop, and now Snake is just really not playing ball for Bulmers. Oh. Yeah, oh no, oh no, it's done it again. This isn't, this isn't quite as funny as how uh, Greeny failed. Uh, you know, we've had a Greeny fail and now a Green a fail. Greeny fail. Uh, he got out, he got out of his car as the, the police car was like hanging over the edge of a bridge and he got out of his car. <laughs> Oh yeah. And he fell down to the bottom of a bridge. Mm. And he's just stood there like... This is life now. Nice freebie by Potato. Oh. Chief Wigan. Hello, Springfield. To be fair, I feel like missing Bob and Cutting Skip is around the same amount of time as failing, losing. Um... Depends. I... yeah. That's probably fair. Because you have another countdown to it. Yeah, it might be a little more the cutscene. Because some bit, of that, like, yeah. Because you probably are around 50 seconds, and you get maybe a bit more because it's time to fail. But there's, yeah. like, talking to Wigger and running over and starting the mission. It's a bit of a long one. So, like, this up. But, yeah, I'd say it's a slight edge to the cutscene being longer. Yeah, not much. Depends how, because that was a long fail as well. Hmm, true. That probably, like, makes it pretty average yeah. to it. Either way, Potato does have a uh, not huge lead, but a noticeable one. Long way to go there. Considering we failed cutscene, like, Potato is... Oh, yeah. And he did seem tilted in, like, 3-1. That yeah. was not... And, like, 3-2, that was not pretty... Hopefully, if he gets like a gets a sight on how he's doing in terms of the race, calm him down a bit. We really yeah. seem to be playing better now. So. Get out of your system quickly. From the less significant missions, going for plow booth strat. Oh, it doesn't get a good start. Oh, no, that was terrible. The thing is, if this doesn't go well, <laughs> interesting <laughs> to send there by Bulmers. Yeah, even though Bournemouth's strat would be a bit slow, Potato has to go for boat jump still, and then... Um, I think that should Yeah, okay. Thank you, Mayor Quimby, for the raid. Hope oh, you look at that. Let me do a raid. Bournemouth gets fast to the moment. Not super quickly, but he has the strat. Welcome, Raiders. We are into the loser's bracket oh, quarterfinals. Potato doesn't get boat jump. And thank you for the tier one sub subscription from Mayor Kumbe. All money goes to charity. Work, okay. He gets a second try and he should have a slight lead out of Lisa looking at the timer. He stink. Oh, his coins are sexy out of Lisa. Yeah, 653. Bulmer's not too far behind himself, 626. Okay, 27 coins. Hero just not deciding to not uh, go for 3509. Both runners at red starting down that track. Got eight seconds in favour of Potato. Dear Potato. Mm -hmm. That's kind of to be expected though, after one failed the cutscene and one uh, failed a mission, like being red, because yeah. the mission is like a 120 split. Yeah, so well, it's be... how you fail it. It's, it's roughly a minute, which I'm probably just under. No, I mean, like, this split um, is like a minute 20. Oh, this bit, yeah. yeah. So, like, that had to be pretty close to uh, PV before making mistakes mm. to be able to fail or miss a cutscene and still be able to do that. So it makes sense of a red going into it. Potato looking good here for this slow not fire. Bombers, it's going to be a bit awkward, but also managing it, yeah? No, I've, had, I've had point B cringes every time you see someone do a slow not fire. Because if you didn't know, Quimby has the comsob. No, ah, I did not know. Do you have any comsobs, Axington? 
Uh, I did. I think I still have a rando console. Oh, rando. Okay. <laughs> I had a couple of 60 comsobs for a while, but... Yeah. To get comsobs, you have to play Ooh. the game, so... Yeah, if one steps off a tree now, but yeah, what? I didn't see if Potato got it. But there has been an interesting new trend in the Shark community recently. What? Rewards what Rando. Oh yeah, that one. I haven't actually tried it yet. I haven't got around to it. Involves playing Shark. <laughs> Some say I am the world record holder of it, so you know. I don't believe that. The rumours are true. Are they? Just rumours. I, I got the God Seed. Oh, okay. Don't really count. Neither of them going for lantern coins. What is this? Ow. Oh. Full plot. But they are going. Well, potatoes gone for stand grind. Bulmers yeah. doesn't get the chance. He's very late for Wait, is Bulmers going to go for Bulmers coins? Oh, that's even. He too couldn't. Late the full stop was miles past it. He's hitting some traffic. Not able to go for a mini grind there. He gets the micro grind. <laughs> Genius play. Getting one coin from that box so you can get. Well, they do say they do say every little helps, so you know. Mm. The supermarkets are available. I noticed it almost because I was expecting to get the whole box and we didn't. Can't believe that was, was that legitimately an intentional micro grind? Always oh, got hit anyone here. Should be fine, end of the mission, but you can't have Wee -woo. The worst part of getting Wee Woo at the end of our mission is purely the fact that uh, the cops can sometimes get in the way of Cletus. Yeah, um you can also get done at the gas station at the end of the mission if you're very unlucky. I like that the near synchronized landing is there, even if they were different jumps. <laughs> Some fun physics with Kato coming out of the ski yard. Are you ready for fun, fun, fun? Fun, fun, fun. We don't, we don't get that in this right category because there's no calling Mr. Plow. Oh, Mr. Burns demo from the phone booth. No fun, fun, fun. No fun, fun, fun. Baby for potato. It'd be very surprising if people didn't get it, having not got the. Uh... I mean, you may main menu off anyway, don't you? You do for one neighbors. Potato didn't do for one neighbors. Mm. Almost, I don't know. Well, Bulmers went too far wide there and was unable to get the loss, so they can eat my rugs. So. It's actually quite interesting the variety of people that we have like still left in the top four. Mm. Or still left in the tournament in general, considering like last year you would have probably only bet Smith would have been back in the top four. Like out of the five names we potentially have, like Oh um, right, C coming into the tournament. Smith, you would say, would probably have been in. I think those good old dumb painter. No, no, I mean, like, after last year's, at the end of last oh. year's 20, like, oh, right. 
You wouldn't um, have thought, like, uh, Potato would be top four. This I don't year. know, Potato was improving very quickly. He was a favorite for the pet bracket. Despite yes. going out in the corner of Potato was showing the fast improvement. Vapor is consistent enough. Like, he's always tends to do well in tournaments. There so was... I, there I, was... I, Bulmers and uh, Haz, I would agree with. I don't think Haz has only just started running the game, to be fair. I don't know, I would have thought that, like... For me, like... Bam and Potato, whilst they were good last year, they... Neither of them really, like, showed any sort of, uh... Even though Bam won the pet bracket, he didn't get anywhere near, like... I think his best time was like a 134, and I think it was seven runs better than his his run. Something like that. Potato is improving very quickly to be fair. He was, but he wasn't showing like the tenacity like when it came to uh, Potentially, but when it came to races, mm. he wasn't showing the same sort of level of like improvement or skill. And no, Potato didn't get anything back of school. Okay, almost decks both on the other hand. Oh, thank you for the, the red green ferret. You get some more green up in here. Oh no, we're getting so many greens. There's green even needed. But Bomber's going into a tournament, I believe, was saying that his aim was to reach um, the same level he got in like 2019, which was uh, fifth, sixth place. So hmm. he's, he's hit uh, that. Guaranteed that, yeah. Doing it pretty close so far against uh, Potato here. You think at this point, Bomber's might even be a little disappointed if he only comes uh, hmm. fifth, sixth. Yeah, I think I mean, when I you go, when you go this deep into well, it, yeah, when you get this close, you've got an eye on the prize, haven't you? Yeah. Even if potato is probably the favourite for this. Oh, potato gets the block this time. Ah, uh, bombers missed the drop, and I said quickly swing around for it. It was pretty because I was learning it for someone. I yeah. I think when you're this deep into a tournament, you kind of want to at least go as far as possible. Yeah. You're definitely within a chat in with a chance at this point. Ignoring even if the uh, tournament predictor says, "What's it say for performance?" 0.46%. Yeah. That's partly because Bournemouth has the most races to do. Playing team potatoes that I use so low. Yeah. Obviously, Smith is going to be the highest because he's already. Smith has one race. Mm. If you look at the number of like potential scenarios for the matches, it's a fifty percent chance based on that that Smith wins. Wow, I can't believe that Ticker Fink says it's good that being a universe got knocked out. Two ten four two. Jeez, it's pretty speedy. All right, is that with ESS or without? I'm not. No, no ESS. Okay, I'm gonna say yeah then. For the last freaking time, tell me about the crap circles. Tell Bombers, how do you feel going into this cutscene? I have hands on potatoes on here. I think potatoes is in a lot happier with his run he did at the start of Lisa. Bombers less confident. I should expand my, uh, like the win percentage model so I can use it mid races based on how far people are ahead. What the odds are. How much does a 20 second leading crap cycles mean? Uh, I'm gonna say not very. Um... Yeah. I actually think, like, a good way to look at things, I'd be interested to see, like, how much out of each level actually, like, dictates. Because I think out of a poo is, like, the most decisive thing. Whereas, like... Mm, yeah. 
Well, I think out of part two and there would be the most decisive because there's so little game to make that comeback. I guess, but I think like it was so much can change. So much can change in Homer 2, but you still have Homer 2 to come out of our photo so. <laughs> Yeah, but I don't know. I get what you're Half saying, is... but I, I yeah. think the problem is you could fail set to go as well. That's like an extra thing. You could, but like. I still think I, I'd still be surprised if like Adavapu isn't like one of the best indicators. Or how much percentage you have to be ahead out of a poo for it to be yeah. like you 90% of the time winning. As well as we do have some like matches changed in like Homer 2, it does seem to be like a missed cutscene will bring it back, or like something like that will bring it back. Unless you're versus Vapo, and then you might as well just not play <laughs> Helmer 2 because you know you're gonna lose. True. Unless you're Smith. Who you did give it a good shot, if I remember correctly. But Vapo had probably one of his worst, like, races in Didn't years. Vapo loses. Sub 130 streak for the tournament, leaving only Smith and the eliminated Duckbottle. And me. At how many Sub 130 races did you have this tournament? Ah, but I didn't lose my streak. You didn't have a streak to lose. You So, you aren't listed in the tournament stats, you don't count. Uh, potato having a fun time with this first try. Do you want to know an interesting. I want to know an interesting statistic. Uh, what's your interesting statistic? Vapo didn't get a, a 130 or worse in last year's 20. Huh. That's pretty good. I mean, all his runs by the last one with Smith were sub 128 this year. Vapo, Vapo's worst time in last year's 20 was a 129. Oh, Clips the box to the bottom as well, it only gets one coin. Ooh. Formers does collect the whole set. Let's go. That's a couple of like coins and patches Formers, missed by Formers potato. Quite a lot here. Very good second shot though by uh and Formers all not as good. Nowhere near as good here. That uh, the wings of destiny. The trap is destined to go backwards and forwards until it's death. A nice freebie as well. Taking the screens past potatoes and oh, and a little look from the third car. That's probably gonna get out. Yeah. Oh, now he's getting canyon narrowed, <laughs> which kind of in some essence helped, but he probably could have done better without it. Almost with a good chance here. No, he doesn't get it. Oh, no. Just bounced out off the fence. Good hit to the bushes though. I mean, that was contact. This is a fair amount of damage. And honestly, this is very close now. Take with the brick of destruction, but almost it's got him here. He might be able to take the jump, which would catch him right back up. 50 14 into the. Uh, Trailer park, just to do that 24 to 10 11 seconds in it. Okay, Bournemouth's making up time this mission. I think. It feels like it anyway. Now, and Potato with the hit and run. Yeah, yeah, you could afford the bust, but you'd rather not. Uh, potato cannot afford a bust. Um, 650 is fine out of that. It's very doable. Showing support for potato. I think House wants potato to win because he feels he's more likely to lose against potato. I'm pretty sure House has last few races he's been wanting to get knocked out. 
Yeah, but the winner of that race wins ten whole dollars. Wow. Your dollar? Yeah, it's dollars, isn't it? Yeah. So potato versus bombers, like you know, this is a twenty dollar match. Mm. No, because this match is a twenty dollar match. The next match between Haz and the winner of this is is oh, ten dollars. Yeah. The potential of going all the way up to hundred. Yeah. It's twenty dollars for a ten dollar match, for another twenty dollar match, for a fifty dollar match. That's a lot of dollars. It could be two fifty dollar matches. If the uh, loser's bracket winner defeats Smith. That is true, yeah. It should, uh, I think, lead to a case of everyone in the tournament, or at least if they went into the uh, main bracket having at least two losses on their record. If Smith were to lose the first set of that first uh, in his match. Uh, if he then went on to win, he'd have to win the second one, yes. I imagine if there's a tie and Bournemouth has to load up his game to the 7 7 high end tie break. I don't think he'd ever considered a tie in an async race. <laughs> that would have been a disaster. Someone's asleep and needs to do a tie breaker. <laughs> we have had to have, uh, well, there has been one tie. Not in this tournament. Oh, no, but he yeah. said uh, Hutch Master won us if this oh. ever happened before. Oh, okay. Yeah, that, that was wow. An NMW race between Rich and Caleb. Double PB on the tie. Both breaking the, one, the 140 barrier in that kind of game. That went down to. Uh, they went to decimals. Yeah, decimals. Below, I bit. believe the, um, the Speed Simpson snap sheet. Oh, Potato's struggling. He's missed a drop. I th oh, is that. No. Is he calling it? Oh, Bulmers has missed the drop. But he's able to back up, but yeah, I think that's it. That was stupid. I brought it back somehow. And then uh, yeah. I had no idea how that. Bulmer spelled 45 is how you pulled it back in the main chunk. Yeah, it just wasn't fun the whole time. Yeah. Marge was fun because I was going fast and then pulled it down. Ad 4-2 was blisteringly fast. Yeah. Uh, maybe I'll watch that back and see how I missed that drop. But I, I, I lined my car up with it on the mini map and went through it and then turned left so I wouldn't hit the fire truck and then didn't have the drop. Like I, I lined like the center of the car up with it on the mini map. You get it. No, I had a lot of dumb things happen. You minus cutscenes get like I think I lost like. On average, 15 seconds to like every single fall of mission. Cola trucks! I went to back up the third car and flips. Uh, and the on first time. car, I couldn't get any damage on because. Did you see what the first car did at the beginning in 4 7? It um, like, almost I... hit the pole on its own at the very start. Um... And I had no clue what to do and didn't get any damage. And then it got out of the strat and had no damage on it. And then the third car I flipped as I was pushing it and lost another like 15. It was just, there were so many dumb things that run, it was, it was just not fun. We're late into the tournament, so I tried to like it out, but then I'm losing a minute and a half this late is kind of GG. Yeah. Mm, you could have won that. But like, it's not, like you probably got like a 127, 128, I'm just not- I got a 127, I don't really care. I, I failed okay. that one cut, part two cutscene, the rest of the run was actually okay. I have to put that on the cutscene. It's not having fun, like, and it's kind of over here. Fun is the most important part, after all. <laughs> like, it started to become more fun as I looked in the more close, and then I have no idea how that drop missed. Mm. I don't understand. <laughs> I, like, like I, I fucking, sorry, excuse me. Like, I've had clips where I drive, like, I'm in first person, and I drive through the edge of the drop, or something like mm. that, but... Obviously, I can't see where my car was. I, I just can't get over how I lined it up on the mini map, like really, uh, really slow, and drove into it and didn't have it. I was in like quarter speed. 
Twitch player only moves in 10 second intervals, so <laughs> he'll find out in 40 seconds, in my opinion. Mm. So that's it for me. I'd have better things to do. Yeah, GG anyway. Mm -hmm. Bournemouth, can you explain 3 5 to us? Um, just another bullshit 3 5 for me. Uh, I was a bit annoyed. annoyed. I was actually kind of really annoyed because that run was actually decent. Well, uh, it was helpish when it started to go bad, and then 3 mm. 5 killed PV, and I was like, fuck's sake. Okay. Um, Having forensically rewatched the, the video, it looks like Potato turned left a bit too early because it's not really. He's done it by the front of the car, I think, not from the middle. So you can kind of see it to the front and right as Potato's camera goes back forwards. Which is just turned too early. It's unfortunate. We have the best journalists here on Sweet Simpsons. If, if, if Twitch had a frame by frame advance on like YouTube, I could show it off. I could like screenshot and post it somewhere, but I have to. Yeah, thank you all for coming by. It's been a been a blast. Uh, the next race will be Bombers versus Has for the losers semi finals. Yay! Highest I've ever been in the tourney. Yeah. My last two races were DNFs. So... Oh. Woo, I shouldn't be here. <laughs> well, you're here, and that's the main thing. How do you feel about this race against Hav? Are you confident? Um, I'm more trying to ask him that. Not to ask him that. Uh, well, okay, you can ask me. I'm, I'm confident enough if Haz doesn't play like he did in his last race, or he got like 125. If I get 133 Haz, that would be ideal. <laughs> <laughs> But um, no, it should, should has the guts to be close as well, and um, I don't know if we'll see an async race. I think has is kind of flexible. I'll have to uh, DM him though. Um, I don't think I can play until Friday though, at least. Maybe Wednesday morning if I get home by then, but we'll see. Looking at the uh, sheet, your last three races have all been 127s. Yeah, very consistent with the L 127s. And then before that was a 128. Uh, yeah, it was 131, right? All my uh, 120. Oh, 126 was before that. Oh yeah. Uh, you've been very consistent. The only time you needed to bust out better than a 127 was versus Crutch, and you did. Mm. I, I, yeah. I don't we'll see. Um, like I said, I have a good route to the final now. I think um, I can beat Haz and I can beat Vapo. It's a um, Smith, so. Smith, on the other hand, I, I don't know. Uh, he's been playing very well, and I have to beat him twice. So you know, we'll see. And, oh, wait, how much am I guaranteed now? Ten. Twenty. 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 Let's go. Let's go. Yes, yeah, so uh, how, what is Has going to spend his $30 on after he smashes Bulmers? Ooh. I think Bulmers and, Has have, uh, Bulmers and Smith have never faced on Speed Simpsons. I personally will spend it all on Speed Simpsons subs. Ooh. No, no. I actually will. That's a charitable donation. Oh, Smith versus Haz final would be really cool. Be, be cool. <laughs> Smith has a three and our record against Haz. <laughs> against but yeah, thank you all for coming by. Uh, I think we'll wrap it up there. Uh, yeah. Thank you, Keith Ram and DJ Lanton. Thank you, Axing Tom. You're welcome. Green and thank you, bars and potato. And thank you, everybody, for joining. Oh, I'm too, I guess. <laughs>